How's it going, my friends? This is Jeff Benjamin with iDownload Blog. I want to show you a new tweet called Repower. What you do is you hold down the sleep or power button, and then you get the power down dialog, but you also get something new here. Have you noticed it? <laughs> you get the uptime. It tells you the uptime of your iPhone in days, hours, and minutes. It also gives you two little handy reboot and respring options. You can tap those to reboot or respring. So basically, from this power down screen, you can power down, you can reboot, or you can respring. If you open up the settings app, you'll see a preference section for repower. And this preference section contains one single toggle that really doesn't work all that well, at least in this version when I've tested it out. This toggle supposedly forces a double tap gesture in order to touch these reboot or respring buttons. But you notice I just tapped it once and it automatically respringed as soon as I tapped the respring button. So that's there as a protection uh, to prevent you know, accidental reboots or accidental resprings. But as you can see, that toggle didn't work very well for me, but I'm sure the developers, Hashbang Productions, they're usually on top of things like this. They'll be on that and they'll fix that up, no problem at all. So that is basically what you do. I'm gonna tap this again, see if it works. Yeah, it just resprung again. So basically don't do that unless you actually wanna respring until they update the tweak. Um, so yeah. No big deal. Anyway, this is called Repower, and what you, what you see here, you see the hours, you see the days, the minutes uh, that your device has been up. So basically, your uptime, you can reboot or respring or power down directly from your power off dialog. If you want to try this out, then head over to Cydia's Big Boss Repo. There you can download Repower free of charge. Let me know what you guys think in the comment section. This is Jeff with iDownloadBlog.